Earth signs. I have a message for you today. Hmm. Let's see what the Hoodoo Tarot has to say. So, we're using oracles as well as the Hoodoo Tarot. I have a romance, angels, and monology decks combined into one. We'll pull 10 messages. So, if you're watching and hopefully enjoying the videos, and there are many other videos on the channel as well. Like, share, comment, subscribe, add value to the channel so the message can spread. Let's go ahead and get your oracle messages pulled first. If you're wanting a personal reading, my information can be found down in the description box below. Wanting to do business or collaborate. My social media accounts can be found there as well see what the oracle messages has to say for the earth signs dealing with who cancer no not cancer we're dealing with getting the moon here <laughs> we're dealing with Taurus Capricorn and Virgo okay what do you need to release waning moon what are the messages we have here for the earth signs you have past life relationship you have known each other before hmm past life co connections Past life relationships. It could be a literal past life relationships or a lifetime it can be 18, 21 years. Sometimes people say a lifetime ago or you don't know the new me or the old me. It's completely different. So it could be that type of dynamic as well. Pay attention to the red flags, the signs of cautioning. Okay. I mean, often you know why you break up with someone. So never go back to someone unless they show some type of level or some level of evolution or change. Believe in the impossible. Blue moons. Conclusions are within reach. Full moon and eclipse. Could be, um, I'm getting reconciliation, but not really. It seems like, uh, what do you call it? Closure. Balance spirituality and practicality, full moon in Pisces. Could be dealing with the Pisces at this time, sun, moon, rising. What else do we have for the earth signs here? Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Could indeed be some type of uh, relaxing retreat, vacation, or honeymoon. Uh, taking time for yourself and the ones that are closest to you. Past life relationships. Again, it could be a reconnection or coming to some sort of a, a closure to begin something anew. Coming to an understanding is what I'm getting. Pay attention to the red flags. Putting all the cards on the table, pretty much. Getting nothing is yet set in stone. Mutable moon. So, uh, maybe there was a divorce hanging in the wings. We also have new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings relationship could have been affected by a new incoming um, love connection or partnership pay attention to the red flags could also be coming across a new uh, love relationship for singles as well multiple stories again all the messages may not resonate for you at this time so uh, don't force the story to fit love yourself first your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive that's the best way it works that is the law of attraction Alright, that's enough Oracle messages. Alright, so Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. What messages do we have for you today from the Hulu Tarot? Miss uh, Tayana McQuiller. Interesting character study. This may also be ancestral messages as well being passed down from your spirit team or your folks. <laughs> Feminine energy. See what the cards has to say for Earth sign Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. What the universe has to say for the Earth signs? Grounding you today. Seven of baskets. Options at this time or confusion. Options, confusion. <laughs> so you're coming to a place where. Um, 
based on the oracles here. They could be new love or they could be um, side projects affecting the state of the marriage. Three of baskets. Yeah, it deals in uh, connection ships and whatnot. Um, could be third parties. But this is dealing in group activity. You can see the image of their... Uh, it's kind of like they're hiding as well. If we're going to go with uh, uh, whosoever story this is in regards to marriage. Uh, but you can see the group of people here. Hiding off in the forest. Having their own extravaganza or get together. Cups or baskets deals in cups which would be our emotions. The love that we have for people. Our empathic nature. Eight of coins. Okay, so you, this could be working together. So this is a group of people working together. Eight of coins. Eight symbolizing infinite energy. Also symbolizing um, a continuation of hard work. Uh, stability. Bringing in coins. It could be creating a foundation together. Or working on a business together here. The seven of baskets entails uh, multiple options. Working on multiple options. Working on multiple streams of, in of income. Ten of baskets. This is a lot of. Uh, this is the happy family, of course, dealing with a lot of people, connections. Maybe some form of a. Um, hmm. Grounding seven of baskets, and we have three of baskets. Jumping to the ten of baskets, wanting to deliver. Um, maybe someone wants to dump on you emotionally. <laughs> it may be. Uh, maybe romantically attracted to you at, at the same time. Son of knives, so this is spying. Someone is uh, very romantically taken with you. They're researching you at this time and trying to figure out how to deliver a message of communication. Extreme, extreme, um, hmm. extreme something. Because he has a knife in his hand. They're going through extreme measures to uh, gather more information on you at this time. Final messages. Two of coins, balance, and equal give and take. So they're wanting to uh, seek equal partnership with you, give and take. This could also be in regards to, um, yeah, this has to be in regards to uh, love and money here. They're trying to deliver a side project to you or a contract to you. They're balancing um, their heart, their monies, uh, balancing their thoughts as well. This could be a Libra energy as well. Mm, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio is what I'm getting. All right. Well, that is your reading for today. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Add value to the channel. If you're needing any personal messages, my information can be found down in the description box below. For your viewing pleasure. All right, Earth signs. Hopefully you enjoyed. Have a good day. Peace.